Before you start, familiarize yourself with the contents provided in your Rapport Classic Vacuum Therapy device system. You will find the Constriction Ring Sizing Guide at the back of your Instruction for Use booklet. To use your Rapport Classic device, you will first need to determine the correct Constriction Ring size. You have received five Constriction Rings with your Rapport Classic device. Select a slot which fits firmly around the base of your flaccid, non-erect penis. Try the largest size first. Each slot has a ring size marked above it, which corresponds to the ring you require. The constriction ring is placed at the base of your penis next to your body, and choosing the correct ring size is important to maintain the erection for the necessary period. Once you have selected the right ring size, you are ready to begin. There are two transfer sleeves provided with your Rapport Classic system. Depending on the size of your penis, you should choose which of the two is likely to be the most suitable. Remember, your erect penis will need to be withdrawn through the transfer sleeve. One of the transfer sleeves included with your Rapport Classic system is already attached to the penile tube. If this is the correct size transfer sleeve for you, you can leave it in place. If not, remove it and fit the remaining transfer sleeve. Fit the loading cone onto the transfer sleeve and apply a little lubricating jelly, included with your system, on top of the cone. Holding the constriction ring by the outer handles, simply stretch and pull the ring down the loading cone until it slips onto the transfer sleeve. Make sure the constriction ring is located on the flat groove at the centre of the transfer sleeve. The constriction ring is now mounted and ready for use. Before continuing, make sure you use the lubricating jelly to lubricate the end of the transfer sleeve. Also, lightly lubricate the penis to prevent it from sticking to the inside of the penile tube during insertion, or while using the pump. The pump head has two small pegs on each side above the orange ring. These should be positioned into the two grooves on top of the penile tube. The two parts are then locked together with a twist so that the two pegs slot down and locate at the lower end of the groove. If these two parts are locked together correctly, it will ensure the unit is sealed tight enough to create a vacuum inside the penile tube. To ensure a vacuum will be created, insert only your penis into the penile tube and apply slight pressure to the seal with the transfer sleeve against your body at the base of the penis. To ensure that a vacuum is created, it may be necessary to groom the hair at the base of the penis. Make sure the constriction ring on the transfer sleeve is in the correct position, with the handles to the top and bottom. Continue pumping slowly to create the erection. If you feel any pain, stop pumping and press the release button to eliminate the vacuum. You can try again when you're ready. Pumping slowly is most beneficial. When the desired erection has been achieved, continue to hold the tube tightly against your body. Ease the constriction ring off the transfer sleeve and onto the base of your penis. Press the release button to lower the vacuum pressure and remove the penile tube. With the constriction ring in place, sexual intercourse can be accomplished. If a condom is to be worn, it should be put on as a last step. Please ensure that the lubricating jelly used with the system is compatible with your condom type. To remove the constriction ring after intercourse, simply grasp the outer handles to stretch the central ring. As the blood is released from the penis, it will decrease in size and the ring may be easily removed. Do not wear the constriction ring for more than 30 minutes at a time and allow a minimum of 60 minutes between uses. Please consult your instruction booklet for a comprehensive set of instructions, safety precautions, warnings, troubleshooting and cleaning instructions.